This is a, a first test flight of a tilt tri quad plane. So this plane is a um, it's an X8 flying wing uh, modelled by Brandon McDougall, and uh, the original specifications for this configuration was supplied by Chris. And so what we've got is a, a flying wing, and uh, if you fly it in a, a hover mode, then all three motors tilt, well, two tilt up and one tilt down. And if you're in a fixed wing mode, then the motors tilt forward like that and to forward flight. And of course, it supports um, elevons as, as usual on an X8 flying wing. Uh, quite high throws I've got set up on those elevons. All right, so what I'm going to do first of all is just uh, pop it into a, uh, a hover in Q loiter mode. And uh, so I'll just disarm that again because I had the throttle high and I will arm it again and tell it to take off. Now it will tilt back a little bit. The center of gravity is quite far back. I'm still sorting out what's supposed to be happening with the center of gravity. But you can see that the aircraft is under control there. And uh, so we're able to do, for example, a forward transition. So to go to forward flight like that. And there it is in forward flight. And it's now a three motor flying wing. So what I'm gonna do is just uh, reset the aircraft. And um, uh, then I'm going to get it set up for an automatic mission. So I'm gonna put it into auto mode. So it's sitting on the ground in auto mode and I'm gonna tell it to arm. It should take off and fly this mission, then come back and land itself. So there it is arming and it'll then take off. A Little bit of back tilt because that center of gravity issue that I still haven't sorted out. And then uh, it should transition to forward flight. There she goes. And then turn into the waypoints. And navigation is going fine and it should come up and then turn around to a final waypoint and come in for a vertical landing. All right. Coming in for the final approach. I've forgotten to turn on engine noises inside the model. I'll fix that for the future version so we can hear the motors revving up a bit more. There it comes in and ready for a vertical landing. And it should start to descend. All right, coming down the last few meters. Then it should slow down just as it's close to the ground. So it's slowing down now. And there it is, it's landed. Okay, hope you've enjoyed that. We'll be refining the model over the next little while. Thanks again to Brandon McDougall and to Chris uh, for help with this model and happy flying.